G'day guys, today we're going to be doing DIY salt ornaments. So I had hoped to do this at Christmas, but the time got away from me. So today I'm going to show you how to make salt dough ornaments and I'm going to be using her handprints and her footprints. Let's get into it. There's only three ingredients you'll need, salt, plain flour and water. So first I put one cup of flour into the bowl and then half a cup of salt and mix together with a wooden spoon. Before I added half a cup of water, mix that together with the wooden spoon. Once it was all pretty much together, I took it out of the bowl, put some flour down on the kitchen bench and then kneaded the dough. I kneaded it together for a couple of minutes. If your dough is still sticky, then just add a little bit more flour. I placed some more flour on the rolling pin before rolling out the dough. So I probably made it about quarter to half an inch thick or half a centimetre to a centimetre thick. I kept these pretty thin, so probably half a centimetre. Sophie wanted to be part of the action, so I've got her in the baby carrier. Then using a bowl, I cut out two circles for her handprint and for Sophie's footprint. I removed the excess dough and put it to the side where I'm going to use to make some teddy bear ornaments. Then I imprinted Sophie's hand into the salt dough. Keeping it real, that was our third attempt. Here were some other ones that Sophie did that just didn't work out. With the footprint, we managed to crack it on the first one. If you want a smooth edge, I'd cut off the excess now. If you're not worried, which I wasn't, then just leave it as is. If you want to hang them up, then you can use a straw to create a hole in your ornament. I had the oven at 120 degrees Celsius, which is 248 degrees Fahrenheit or 250 degrees Fahrenheit, it's close enough. The handprint ornaments, I left them in there for three hours and I turned them over halfway through because they were still wet in the middle. Whereas those teddy bear ornaments, they lasted an hour and a half and they were done and I didn't even need to turn them over. Once they were dry, I used some gold metallic paint and painted the footprint. I used the Gorilla Glue to attach the ribbon to the back. So following its instructions, I wet the back with my finger, then I applied the glue and then I put down the ribbon and I used this Play-Doh container to just hold it in place until it dried. I broke a bit of the dried salt dough off with my fingers, but if I wanted it to be smoother, you could use some sandpaper to smooth it off. I think this is a cute little keepsake of Sophie's handprint and footprint when she was nine months old. But you can also use it to create any other ornaments. It works really well and dries super hard. I think this is a really precious memory and a keepsake of her hands and feet as a nine month old. Let me know in the comments below what you've kept as a baby keepsake. All right, until next time, take care. Bye.